Believe it or not, North America was inhabited by some of the most frightening beasts after the Ice Age that you certainly wouldn't want to come into contact with. During the Jurassic period, fierce carnivores relied on being the fastest, the most intimidating, and having razor-sharp teeth in order to survive. You'll consider yourself lucky that these frightening animals are no longer around. Here are the most terrifying extinct animals of the Americas. But first, a quick shout out goes to Flying Knight for leaving us this comment. Occasionally I might practice my Slovenian in my spare time. Let us know which of these animals you think is the scariest and maybe we'll feature you in an upcoming video. Number 12. The Short-Faced Bear Coming into contact with a short-faced bear must have been absolutely horrifying for our caveman ancestors during the Ice Age. This photo here shows a comparison of an average man and one of these beasts, and you can tell that it would have been taller than us on all four legs. There aren't a ton of animals in modern times that can pull off such a feat. These were mostly abundant in California and would have been one of the largest known terrestrial animals that ever walked the planet. Needing about 35 pounds of fresh flesh a day to survive, you can tell it had quite the appetite. Although they would scavenge less often than modern day bears, they were still rather opportunistic in their eating habits. Number 11. Quetzalcoatlus This is by far the largest bird to ever exist and would have been truly astonishing to witness in real life, maybe even horrifying. These existed sometime in the late Cretaceous period and some estimate that these birds would have actually had a wingspan of 52 feet, making them the size of a small aircraft. They could have actually walked upright at a size of about 35 feet. Normally, we imagine birds being a little bit smaller and this was truly more terrifying than Big Bird from Sesame Street. Paleontologists debate whether or not this beast was actually able to fly or not, but if it was capable, it would certainly be able to glide for long distances. Number 10. The Titanoboa If you don't like snakes, you certainly wouldn't like coming across a Titanoboa. These mega snakes lived 60 to 58 million years ago and hold the record for being the longest snakes in the existence of Earth. They measure nearly 40 feet long and would have weighed 2,500 pounds. These creatures were able to thrive in tropical climates where Earth's temperature was slightly warmer, causing more rainforest around the globe during the Cretaceous period, which took place from 145 million years ago to 65 million years ago. Number 9. Sabertooth Cats Imagine coming into contact with a giant cat with two large fangs that would make any modern day tiger run away in fear. In fact, this wasn't even a tiger, but more like some kind of giant panther that we believe could have weighed about a thousand pounds. The impressive long dagger-like teeth were perfect for slaying large herbivore animals such as mammoths and rhinos. These teeth began to develop at the age of three so they would be able to hunt with their family. The saber-like teeth were perfect for popping the jugglers of prey and they measured as long as seven inches. Theories vary about why these large predators went extinct, but some tend to believe that they could have been hunted to extinction or from a climate change around the end of the Ice Age about 11,500 years ago. Number 8. Giant Centipedes you probably would not want to take a time machine back to 300 million years ago. These creatures were just as terrifying. Take this giant centipede for example that was easily longer than a human and could have grown to be up to 8 feet long. That's seriously a creepy crawler you don't want to get close to. Luckily these things only ate plants but you can imagine how terrified it would be if you saw one of these brush up against your leg. Eventually as the climate became drier this species began to die out, thank goodness. Number 7. The Velociraptor This terrifying creature was made famous from films such as Jurassic Park. These are described as being about 6 feet from head to tail and were relatively small in height. They lived about 75 to 71 million years ago and their fossils have been found in places such as Kanda and Mongolia. But don't let their size fool you. They are excellent predators and with many weapons in their arsenal. This includes their razor-sharp sickle-shaped claws on its lower feet that would have been used to tear into the skin of their prey. There is some evidence to support the theory that velociraptors would hunt in packs, almost like vicious wolves. These dinosaurs were somewhat similar to flightless birds and had feathers but with sharp teeth. Number 6. Dire Wolf One of the more well-known prehistoric canines on this list, the dire wolf was a carnivorous predator that once roamed around North America. This was the largest species of wolf to walk the earth and hunting in packs, they were nearly unstoppable. They could take down a prey about 10 times their size and fight off predators twice their size. A baby woolly mammoth wouldn't stand a chance against a pack of raging dire wolves. 
Some of the largest collections of fossils from this animal come from the Rancho La Brea tar pits of Los Angeles. Dire wolves would often try to attack animals that got stuck in tar pits, thinking that they were an easy target and then got trapped themselves. They existed and thrived in large areas whether it was grasslands, forested areas, plains, and so on. Their area was mainly limited to areas away from extreme temperatures. It turns out their relatives, the gray wolves, would survive the test of time and be better equipped to survive the megafaunal extinction event around 12,700 years ago. Number 5. Giant Sloths If you thought sloths were already terrifying, just be glad you didn't live during the Pliocene era. These ground sloths were the size of elephants and lived anywhere from South America to as far north as Utah. They would have weighed 4 tons and could have measured 20 feet from head to tail. Their size would have only been exceeded by a few animals like rhinos during this time. Although the giant sloth would seem like an easy meal to animals like the saber-toothed tiger or dire wolf, they had huge claws that measured 12 inches in length. The sloth flourished up until 10,500 years ago when it was likely overhunted by more advanced human species. We had to make it to the top of the food chain somehow and cavemen were concerned with the preservation of endangered species when survival was on the line. Number 4. Allosaurus This species of carnivorous dinosaur lived from 155 million years ago to 150 million years ago. It would have looked absolutely horrifying with dozens of sharp serrated teeth and would have been about 39 feet in length. It was one of the more common predators and often on the top of the food chain, consuming other herbivore dinosaurs and even eat other predators if it needed to. Similar to the dire wolves, it hunted in packs. Just a few of them could take down mega giants like this Barosaurus trying to defend himself. Quite a few of these have been discovered in northwestern states and places like Wyoming. One of the best preserved specimens is named Big Al. It's currently on display at the Museum of the Rockies at the University of Wyoming Geological Museum. When it comes to comparing the T-Rex and the Yellowsaurus, the Yellowsaurus had the weaker jaws of the two, but its mouth could open up wider. Number 3. The Dino Nikus. Fossils from this extinct horrifying creature have been discovered in U.S. states including Montana, Utah, Wyoming, and Oklahoma, but also some teeth have been found as far east as Maryland. The name translates from Greek to mean, mean terrible claw, which definitely helps it make it on our list. This type of raptor was a lot smaller than previous dinosaurs like the Allosaur, but can move with exceptional agility and grace that hadn't been seen before in the Cretaceous period. There's really no other creature like this in modern times, but it would possibly be like making a hybrid of a cassowary with the fierceness of a wolverine. The main reason it earns the name of Dinonychus is because of the large sickle-shaped talon that's found on the second toe of each hind foot. This species would have been about the height of a toddler, but a whole lot scarier. Their razor-sharp teeth could easily rip through the flesh if their claws didn't get the job done already. Number 2. Tyrannosaurus rex The most horrifying well-known dinosaur known as the Tyrannosaurus rex would be a downright evil-looking creature if we ever saw one alive. These things lived 68 to 66 million years ago during the Upper Cretaceous period. The most complete skeletons we have to date of these large reptiles measure in at 40 feet in length and would have weighed an estimated 8 tons. The 15 foot tall creature would have only eaten meat and even each other sometimes. Evidence seems to indicate cannibalism with this species and they would often interact with each other violently, especially when there was a lack of food. We imagine these fights were pretty epic. One thing is certain, if we ever decide to clone any of these terrifying animals, we better be careful. Number 1. Megalodon If you're not frightened by a giant 60-foot shark that once swam in the oceans around North America, we're not exactly what sure will. This thing was once roaming the seas about 23 to 2.6 million years ago with a gaping jaw large enough that a person could actually stand inside like we see here. Each tooth is about the size of your hand and they had 276 of these. They can certainly swallow you whole in one gulp without even taking a bite though. This is considered to be the most powerful vertebrate predator in all of history. These guys ate whales for breakfast and sea cows for a snack. Fossils of whales show huge bites of them being ripped out. This beast needed a massive amount of food to stay alive and it certainly got just that when it was able to spot a potential prey with also the most powerful bite of any known species. So what do you guys think was the most mysterious? Let us know in the comments section and don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you next time.